Hello friends and family, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Iget, aka underscore the shaky queen. Um, if this is your first time on my channel, please, please subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, like, comment, and share, and tell me what more of my videos you want to see. Yes. Um, so today I'm going to be talking about a different topic. I was supposed to post a different video because on my channel I said that there was going to be a big announcement and I said what the video was going to be about but today I chose to film a different video um, talking about a situation that's actually going around and it's actually it has actually triggered me because I think this is very important not just in that certain country but like all over the world so as you can probably see by the title of the video this is going to be about that YouTuber, that Korean YouTuber named Jun Lee. Um, if you don't know who he is, he's on YouTube. Um, I didn't know who he was, but thanks to the channel that I watch, um, it's called Malia and Jay. That's where I got the information from, and I was like, "What? Like, what is she talking about?" And then, like, when I went to go look at it, it, it was this video that's circling around. Apparently that him bashing black women and that didn't sit well with me. Um and I was like sometimes when you sometimes when it comes to your race you just gotta stand up and like talk about it. I'm sorry guys, if you see me looking over here like I can see myself, but don't mind that. Sometimes when it comes to your race you have to fight for your people. Like, I don't care who you are. You can be black, you can be white, you can be whatever color you want, I don't care, but right now I'm speaking for the black girls, the black people in general. Um, I'm not speaking for all people. Actually, let me rephrase that. I'm not speaking for all people, I'm speaking for me personally and probably like a couple of people who will feel this way. Um, when it comes to black girls, we're downgraded so much and I hate that. We're not, people see us as like worthless, people don't respect us, and it's just getting out of hand. So the video that's circling around, it's basically him asking Korean teenage boys like what they think about, what they think about black girls, and they're basically saying, oh, I would never date a black girl because they're ugly anyways. And then the, the big title in the video like the thumbnail is like pretty for a black girl like if you're black you probably have heard that before like a million times and i hate it and it's like pretty for a black girl like what are you talking about like i hate it so much it hurts me deeply because i'm a black girl and the video that I was actually supposed to post was talking about me struggling a black girl struggling because she likes K-pop because I've heard so many things so many negative things but for people to just go around and bash black women like that it's just something that will never change and I'm not saying that it's only in Korea because here also in the US um, black people are not seen as like people to a certain extent and that ish is really irritating um, so I feel sorry, and I just want to say this, sorry to the black girls that actually had to go through this with him, because he does have a couple stories where, like, he's, like, messaging black girls on social media, asking them to be in his videos to pretend to be his girlfriend and stuff like that, and he, he basically, like, he's known for, like, going in the streets and, like, apparently educating Korean people about black culture and I'm like the first thing that popped into my mind was like how are you trying to teach Korean people about black culture like you yourself you're not black just because you're like oh I have black friends that's something we hear every day in the black community when someone who's non-black tries to like defend themselves while they have said something messed up or whatever but I watched a couple of his videos and 
this guy basically his channel is just like based on like black girls and for the way for me I for the way I saw that I saw that as like he, he has some type of like obsession or like fetish about black girls and that's really disgusting because first of all if you love someone or their culture a lot of people tend to like culture appropriate everybody no actually let me rephrase this everybody wants to be black everybody want to associate themselves with black people but when it's actually time to be black when it's actually time to like okay can you face what black people face on the daily no here in america we've been having like news about like black people being kidnapped especially women being kidnapped going missing and that's really something that's been sitting in the back of my mind that i didn't want to talk about i don't usually talk about these kind of things on my channel i usually just vlog or just sit down and like talk about like a happy topic and i just couldn't stay quiet about this and talking about this like makes me feel emotional but i'm not gonna cry on camera because black people i don't know i just I, I feel so angry like i don't even know what to say and it's so sickening and it's so tiring every single day i feel like we have to fight for who we are we have to fight For our, we have to fight because of the skin color we're in. We have to fight every single day about different things, and it's honestly like so tiring. I can go like down with the list of like things that's happening. This guy must be stopped. Like, if if you want to educate black people, I mean, if you want to educate. Korean people about black culture um, I'm sure there's like plenty of videos of like black people explaining their cultures I'm sure there's like plenty of things articles like do your research don't just stop people on the street and ask them oh how do you feel about this oh or like how do you feel about black girls who cares why, why does he always have to be black girls why does he always have to be how do you feel about black girls how do you feel about something and one comment that triggered me in that video that i didn't even finish watching because i was kind of pissed i just like turned it off because like it was disgusting i couldn't watch any further like it was hurtful basically they talked about how like black girls have like big hips like they look like horses i was like really really I can sit here and say that it's always those who are so unattractive that you think that people like you. It's always those people that feel like they're better than others just because your skin color is different. That's that's to me that's like so crazy and I hate that and I think his channel should be like banned or something like his channel should just be like cancelled period um, he should find another content to talk about because it's not right to bash another person's race like I don't care who you are like I don't care I would not sit on this camera and just like bash you know like a white person or another black person or like an Asian person like that's not how I was raised that's not my character but apparently that's not how everyone was raised and like everybody has their own opinion but at the end of the day sometimes when it comes down to your own race you have to fight for your people and us talking about it um a couple of black girls that I've seen talking about this topic I think us talking about it will raise I hope this helps someone or even one person like really just like i hope this gets around so people can see what the problem is here um that black people are always just put in this box that we're, we're bad people that we're this and if we don't want to do this with like cer a certain person like oh like automatically we're like oh you're ugly okay but guys we just need to love each other 
and just understand each other's thoughts and thinking, I guess, because if I say learn about each other's culture, because I'm not going to say that because some people just don't know how to learn, learn how, some people just don't know how to learn about other people's culture um, without appropriating without appropriating the culture so yeah I think that's all I wanted to say I think that's all I had I had in my heart to rant about because after hearing about it yesterday um, I couldn't sleep properly without like waking up the next morning and wanting to do this video so if you like this video um, please comment please subscribe Tell me what more you want to see. Um, and yeah, and please follow me on my social medias. I'll try to put it down at the link. Um, I don't I don't think I usually do that, but like I'll put that at the link. You guys can um, follow me on all my social medias. But yeah. Stay tuned for more, vi for more videos. Um, I don't know if I'm going to release the other video, but if I do, then you guys would just know about it. Um, turn on your... Um, your bell notification because you might not know when I post the next video um, I'm gonna try to be as consistent as I can with the holidays and everything um, I didn't have time to edit because there was so much going on but I promise I'm gonna I'm trying to get out a good vlog for you guys maybe like a New Year's party that I'm going to I'll probably vlog that but other than that that's all I wanted to talk about um, if you want to check out the video of that guy bashing whomever just type in his name i guess um it's also gonna be in the title so thank you for coming to my channel subscribe 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 tell your tell your friend tell a friend tell a friend and i'll see you next time bye